Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Spyro the Dragon 2 Ripto's Rage. Andres plays. Last time we went to Breeze Harbor. It is a world that is down in the courtyard of Autumn Plains. And we went to Scorch, which I had mistakenly confused for another world instead of being like this Irish Celtic world. It was in fact a desert world. Today we are going to start with Fracture Hills. And you know what? This is probably the, the level that I just mentioned, the Celtic one. You know it's Celtic because there's going to be fawns that want to sing and dance. I think that's Celtic. My brain saying Celtic, but now it's thinking Greece because fawns were... Greek as well. My mythologies get so jumbled at the best of times. Celtic, it's the music. They're Scottish fawns! Ah! Oh, and he turned to stone. Ah, where's Mahagas? Hello. Hello there, Mr. Dragon. <laughs> You're pretty cute for a quadruped. I wish I could take you on a tour of our temple, but a bunch of lousy earth shapers have encased it in stone. Oh. Well, let's see how we can help uh, fix that. First, our flames can unpetrify the other fawns. I wonder if Alora comes from this world. Thank you for releasing me. Seder, that's it. Trapped in stone. Okay. So our I do know that we have another guide here. It's Three laps of supercharge. That will probably be easier later. So I'm not going to get too hung up over over it. Well, maybe. We could try. That's two satyrs opening up the temple. This area does have some con- Oh, is this- Oh, it's the living bushes! They want to eat Spyro! Oh, jeez! Let me finish making my joke first before you actually eat him. Okay, what is over he here? I knew I didn't go into this building. Okay. Do I want to go down? Okay. Boom. These earth shapers are are able to be defeated. Boom. Into the lava. You just gotta be patient with them. Boom. Oh boy. And boom. Boom. This one is gonna take a bit, but he's in the way. One more. 
Boom, into the lava. Okay. Into the... That should have put him into the lava for sure. Boom. 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 Get back in the lava! Boom! Oh! Boom. Okay. There is an area where we cannot easily destroy the Earth uh, Shapers. And that is the area where we just really have to move the guys out of our way. I think one more. Boom! Okay. So, looking around... Everything now looks clear down here, so let's go up. And now we're ready to proceed. Burn the bushes. That tree has a beehive in it. That's gonna be a living bush. Oh. Okay, I gave the living bush, the bushels, too much credit. Our third satyr! Open the temple some more. Kaboosh! Okay. Burn down the trees. We're actually doing really good. The next... Our fourth Seder has already been saved. Okay. Uh... Nothing sparkling over there. Let's get our fifth Seder. Oh, I do see that we have... So there's one more and that will... Uh, fully open up. To be free. Now there's only one Seder left to rescue. Yes. Also, the uh, creature to give us uh, butterflies in this stage is, in fact, the little piggies. So we're at 15. Clear out all of this. Okay, we have some more rock shapers, earth shapers we can defeat. Should have knocked him into the lava last hit.
One. Two. Oh. I can just wombo combo them. Well, that's helpful. Wombo combo. Wombo combo. Burn that bush down. And let's awaken the last satyr. Do 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 And that breaks off the last bit of the stone. Look at that beautiful temple. You all the satyrs in Fracture Hills. You ought to explore the temple. I will. Okay. Nope. I need to get you off the road. And I need to get him off the road. Okay. Okay, we'll see how well this uh, three lap thing works. Up. Because right now it is not looking good. Uh, let's actually get the quest. Perhaps you can help. My friend is locked in this room and lost the key. Do you know how hard it is to find a locksmith at this time of night? Break down the door. This is why three laps is really difficult, by the way. Because it's three laps of this whole zigzagginess. Of which I do get better at. But then I get moments like that. Where I bang my head on the geometry. Let's go. Jump. One lap. Pretty sure we're still good. Because we technically did not stop running. Three laps! Now let's go break that door. It actually took me so long in my personal playthrough to get three laps. I had to come back later. Oh, thank goodness you broke that door down for me. I thought I'd be stuck in here forever. I found this fancy orb in here. Please take it. Absolutely, we'll take the orb. So now that we got the skill point and we've got the uh, orb and all that.
Let's get the last of these gems. And we're not actually going to deal with Hunter's orb quest right now. The reason why is because even if we do his orb quest now, when we have to come back and do the second one, he will not be ready for us to do the second orb. We have to do the second orb, the first orb quest again. And it becomes tedious and troublesome. Just stand still, he says. I'll turn your boots to gold, he says. Oh, hi, Spyro. You're a sight for sore eyes. I'd appreciate it mightily if you could locate that alchemist. He owes me a favor. Well, we are not going to locate the alchemist for you, Hunter. We are instead on the lookout for... Oh. Oh. I have to do the charge once more because there's actually a secret. Okay. So the charge once more with feeling. Oh. What? Okay, I'm supposed to go up. Ah, I'm supposed to go up. Okay. So it's not really a secret, more so it's where some more gems are hidden. And the best way to do that is... By making the jumps go. I am glad that they actually changed the rules for the supercharge. Yes, there are areas with supercharge ramps. Boom. But for the most part, you go through a gate and it'll give you supercharge and that's super awesome. Okay, now where is the temple entrance? Right here. Hello. Don't mind me, I'm just collecting all of the Hi, gems. You're probably expecting me to say, you're my hero. Thanks for saving poor help is this for me. Sorry, short stuff. I was only in here because I like the peace and quiet. Anyway, the other fawns wanted me to give you this talisman. Wow, Sheila, you're kind of rude. Well, that's okay. If we look at this, we know that Hunter gives us two orbs that we're going to come back back for later we've got our skill point and we got ourselves all the gems so for now this level is done Now I suspect that music is supposed to be like the satyrs are playing music that the earth shapers actually like. But you can also see it as the satyrs are playing mind control music to now mind control the earth shapers. So good thing we got out there when we did. Now is there another level or is it going to be the speedway next I think there's one more level yes there is we have magma cone ugh uh 
Yeah, we'll do magma cone. Magma cone is a full stage. I'm pretty sure it's shorter than Fracture Hills. I believe it is, again, satyrs and fawns. Or is it wizards? It's a different kind of satyr. Oh my goodness, his friend got crushed! And he doesn't care! What the heck? Oh, my best friend that I've known since birth just got flattened by a magma rock. It's okay, though. He's okay. Oh, gosh. Oh, there are more fawns. I'm afraid it's been cancelled because the stupid earth shapers set off the volcano. Okay, so it's the earth shapers once again causing mischief. I wonder what the overall world of Avalar looks like. Because now we know that Breeze Harbor and Zephyr actually exist kind of in the same plane of existence. And based on what we've seen here now... Oh, I see what we're supposed to do. We're supposed to get the Earth Shapers on the X. Okay. Round and round and round we go. Where were we stopping? Nobody knows! Where'd the guy go? Okay, so... These little juveniles still can't be hurt by fire. Good to know. And what's down here? Okay, some more purple gems. Okay, and I don't think I can get these ones from here. If I can... No. I have to go around for those. Is that by here? Okay. So part of me wants to deal with the big stone shapers first. Earth shapers first. So let's go see what I can do this way first. What weird noises this game is producing. Like a frog that's not a frog. Okay. We'll take all of those. And now we'll come back. There's the delinquent. Boom. And bump you into the trap.
Yeah, I'm like hearing this weird. Is that part of the music, or is that just there's an enemy somewhere here croaking at me? I think it's part of the music. Okay. And now... Chisel him to death! You know, these satyrs are far more maniacal and dangerous than the... Sorry, not satyrs. These fawns are more evil and devious than the satyrs on Fracture Hills. Yes, laugh your evil heart out. Is there a shortcut back up here? Now that we've made it. Well, if it okay. Isn't my best customer, the elevator in the next room can take you to the volcano. You can have unlimited use of the elevator for a one-time fee of only a few gems. I still have so not looked up his uh voice actor, but I definitely will at the end of this episode. So, what is this way? Okay, so there were secrets. What's inside the volcano? Oh, it's this one. Hello, Hunter. Hey, Spyro. Check out this cool cave I found. Let's play a little game. Every so often, a piece of this crystal popcorn pops out of the ground. The first one to grab ten of them wins. I'm ready when you... Sure, let's play. So the idea is to kind of beat Hunter. Go where Hunter goes and beat him to the crystal. Ten. Okay, you win. Here's and we got ourselves an orb for that challenge. I'll give you another orb if you can beat me again. Let's play to fifteen this time. I'm ready when. So same thing. Okay, only now he's grabbing it faster. Nope. Hunter, I can't see where you are.
Ugh, I don't like that. Oh, that's so mean. Twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Ah, you're really good. I'm gonna have to come up with some harder games. For now, I'll take this orb. I guess you earned it. Yeah, this one actually was quite challenging. I failed the first time. But we managed. And there is no gem down here. So, let's head back up. Oop. Okay. Looks like we now head back this way. Oh, ow. Oh boy. Okay, and... There we go. And now let's go take the elevator. Which is this thing. Okay, welcome to the volcano. It is very dangerous down here. Let's make sure we get all of the gems down here first. Perfect, okay. So, the puzzle here is we have lava boulders coming around. And we have to be careful not to get hit by them. And back and forth. And that caps off the volcano top. Thanks for closing the lid on the volcano, Spyro. Things were getting a little too hot around here. By the way, here's a talisman I was saving for the party later. I think you deserve it more. Oh. What? It's a cop. It's a cup for their alcohol. It's a party cup. Brilliant. Hey, Spyro. You're just in time for the party. Well, you would be if those nasty lava monsters hadn't stolen our hats. <sighs> it just won't be the same without party hats. Shoot down the lava monsters. Okay. Weird crocodile things. Ow! Okay. I kind of get it. Boom. Ow. 
No. Uh, I will destroy you. Boom. Oh, there's one more there. Boom. Oh, there's actually another one. Okay, let's go fly through the loop again. This is actually an interesting challenge because it's different. And boom. Boom. Oh boy. Okay, back up. And now back down. Okay. Where are these gems falling down to? There's one. There's another one. Okay, now we have all. There's one left. Right here. Boom! Thanks, Spyro. You saved the party. Here, this got mixed in with the cheese balls, and I almost chipped. Oh, and he almost chipped the tooth. With that, that's another world. Another world done. Let's head on up and head on back. So, boom! Oh. Oh my gosh. They, he just murdered someone. Let, let's go back to the party. Nobody's gonna miss Harold. Oh boy. Oh boy. With that guys, we are done another set of levels here in Autumn Plains and Spyro the Dragon. Thank you all so much for joining me. If you guys enjoyed today's episode, please leave a comment in the comment section below. Mash the like button and subscribe if you have not for more Spyro the Dragon content. In the next episode, we have... Oh. Shady Oasis. I thought that was a flight, actually. Ah, there's the flight. And speed, Icy Speedway. Then we will finally be able to talk to Alora and open the, dun the way to the level. So, that is all going to be next time. I hope you guys enjoyed. We will see you all then. Derez Plays is out.